with you. Uh, the, yeah, it's okay. Yeah. I mean, I, I get your point. I don't fully agree that this is a win draft for Vietnam. I just feel that, yes, there, there's a much more comfortable approach for Vietnam when it comes to the game. And I always yeah. say that, that if you have multiple win conditions compared to your opponent, almost always will win in the game. Because if in a high pressure match, yeah. whoever finds their win condition will obviously yep. win the game. But knowing that Philippines think, only have this yeah. linear way of doing this, one dimensional with the link, maybe it. Yep. Will, if it's the one that will make them suffer because of this. Definitely, man. Uh, I think what you're saying in layman is the easier, the better. You know, the make it simple. Make it simple. Simplicity. Yeah, make it is, simple. Uh, beauty. beauty. Well, <laughs> oh, yeah, it's beauty. What? Double Little Wonder take for Team Philippines and Flap TZ on this okay. Masha is already working onto the bottom lane. T Max is here. Who's gonna take the orange? It's gonna be Flap TZ. It's okay. good party for Flap T for Flap TZ. By the way, this is an off lane back here. Yeah. Oh, I think we uh, we saw that in the previous games as well yeah, uh, to a matchup with the Masha. Right? You know what? Different. You know what? Uh, Team Philippines, they're taking advantage of their uh, early damage in taking the jungle because. That's right. Um, what lacks with the Bruno is that it's not a, a like it's not a, a, a hero that can kill a jungle creep early. He needs a support with him. So with this Team Philippines, Carl TZ, he is uh, doing well and uh, they're getting him fed right now. So again, it's still the same wolf uh, with the previous <laughs> games. Uh, both is. of the teams playing it safe. But right now, Team Philippines, they're leading uh, with, uh, with, with just a little bit with this Ling fast pace jungle game. Man, you're staying a little bit, but this is actually too much. 5.1k for Team Philippines. And Ooh. I'm looking at the EXP right now. It's 7,200 for Philippines, okay. only 4.9k okay. for Vietnam. That's massive. Look at the EXP. Yeah. They're leading by a lot. That is a lot. Yeah, I agree with you. Speaking of a lot. Let's make it bigger because uh, Carl Tizzi will now pick off a hero, Trung Trin. That is going to be the first blood of the game. And right now, they're setting up the bottom lane. That is a fire burst. Plus, Carl Tizzi going in. Flap Tizzi with his arm. There you go. Another kill. Okay. Okay. You... Are, are we going to see it, Wolf? Are we gonna see the TZ brothers again? Maybe, but uh, man, the MV MVP of that clash was definitely few. Like moving forward against the T Max Baksha and then pushing him back with a certain target. There's a thing of beauty from our uh, from our captain of Team Philippines. Now yeah. onto the middle, a little bit of a move now for Vietnam, but with the turtle taken out oh. by Philippines, that's amazing. It's oh. Amazing. Man, is working think... on the orange buff once again with you in here. Yeah, dude, I think. Yeah. yeah, I think this is gonna be dangerous for Vietnam because Carl TZ, this is now his A game. This is is now comfortable in this state. Top Look lane. at this. He's gonna make this the Carl TZ show right now. That's right. They're able to take a uh, the Esmeralda from T Vietnam. That try. He's gonna lose his head now. Onto the middle, they will set up for the kill onto Lusty, but Lusty is far too prepared for this. Yeah. Oh, I think I was mistaken, Wolf. Uh, Team Philippines. This is the earliest tower that they uh, got in, in, uh, in the whole series. Plus, Curtis, look at the damage, dude, of this guy. Level 8 against level 4. Oh, man. Team Philippines. Is this a snowball wolf? It well, is. I think it's it is. Like it. Yes. It's looking like it because that is another tower take for the team. Esmeralda now going in, but Carl TZ, he knows. That is the disengage. That is the tyrant's rage. And that will be four kills in total for Team and Philippines. One kill per minute. Lasted with a perfect read in there. Just uh, uh, standing his ground, holding his ground. Now he charges. Nasset land the stun onto T Max, but it doesn't matter because they will be pushed. Turbo Masha moments. Now Carl TZ finds the joint with Rebo in here. Uh -huh. Just uh, stepping on the Cyclone Eye. Broly is safe as well. Vietnam at least leaves for this, but Philippines are leading by a lot. It's 5,000 in the bank for Philippines, 4 0, and Ling is well fed, Turtle to say the least. Yep. Soon. 
You know what, Team Philippines, they got the 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 promo in getting the insurance. Oh my. <laughs> Look, another play, man. From yeah. Few. I kept your, I get the reference, but I was just astonished of what few can do with yeah. this um, Valier. Oh, Valier. Again. doing it again, right? He moves forward, the um ahead of the the backshot that pushes him back out of the revitalized zone, and I think yeah. that's, that's just amazing to watch. High IQ plays from few. That's why he is the idol of the kids here. Oh, yeah. in our country look at this dude team philippines putting up the pressure in the bottom side now transitioning into the mid there's a knock up coming in from the uh, dog people carl tz even uh, popping the, the recall on top of the wall that's how confident these guys are this is such a huge lead right now wolf six minutes in team vietnam they're still waiting for their health insurance, they're still waiting for Broly to, to be online. But when is that going to come in? That is the question. Because right now, all of the farm, all of the resources is now being in the hands of Team Philippines and Team Vietnam. How can they come back? Look, how can they come back? And be, I'm not looking at any good uh, choices now for Vietnam. Maybe because they haven't been looking for kills onto Broly. But... This is mostly because of how Team Philippines are able to to control the early game. Yes, it's it's very hard for me to look for ways for them to win it. I guess when Philippines makes a mistake, but it's not likely to happen. As even with this Baksha, oh. they are so yeah. anchored with their pick. It feels like this pick is not living up to whatever. Doesn't have yeah. an item yet. Like it's already seven yeah. minutes in Manjin, and there's no full item yet on this yeah. Baksha, save for its. Uh, it's boots yeah. but man that's nothing that's absolutely yeah. nothing at this point this is uh so underwhelming for uh, the tanks here for uh for uh team uh vietnam Ma meanwhile uh team philippines now having two three core items in their pockets if i'm not mistaken uh that's going to be the corrosion site incoming for uh the masha meanwhile we're now having a fight here in the bottom side there you go quick snaps quick kills or Team Philippines yeah. getting Team Max once again. And you know it's trouble when your Baksha melts like that, Manjin. Yeah. You don't want that to happen at all. You want your Baksha to be in the front line, so up so much damage, like stay there, uh, make the opponents commit. And the middle though, you want to be able to oh. eliminate one. That's a Kufra down for the cop, but that's just the utility for Philippines. It's just a tank. And uh, as good yeah. as it, I feel it oh was, my. more of that. Yep. The Flickers are now owning the Purify game. Team <laughs> Philippines. Man, Carl TZ. Yeah. Carl TZ is now on that Berserker's Fury. So, Team Vietnam again staying in their base. Man, I, I, man I, I'm lost for words. Let's go to game five, I think. I think this is it. I, like, I'm not seeing any way that on how Team Vietnam can probably win this. I agree with you, probably whenever uh, Team Philippines make a play and if ever they go for sour moves, like if they yeah. go, go into the deep or they make a mistake. But because, um, but with that, for Team Vietnam, man, that's that's bad news because you're, you're, you're depending oh, no. on the errors oh, of your no. enemies. Oh, Max Rage! Oh, man, Tyrant's for the... Rage! For the third time, few outplaying this Baksha. Every time the Revita is puff, he's just pushed away from it. And that's a waste for Team Max. Oh my goodness, Philippines are getting everything they can. They found another. They go for the job. Curl TZ with the kill. The Godlike streak. Can he get another one? Yes, he can. That's the kill on the Esmeralda. Now, who can defend from Vietnam? No one. Maybe hide, no one. but he doesn't have anything to work with right now because if he pops the feather, there's like he's going to be taken out. Nine minutes, oh. 30 seconds, Manjin Philippines are knocking at their doors and have taken two inhibitors. And Team Vietnam, is this their last stand for this game? Team Philippines now owning the base and they're throwing everything in the kitchen sink. They want to end this game, but there you go. Uh, Flap TZ even putting the cherry on top in getting the Lord. This is it, Wolf. This is the death march 
of the Team March. Philippines towards, towards Team <laughs> Vietnam. Oh man. Well Philippines have really broken Vietnam. Because here's the thing, Manjin. When Vietnam is winning, yep. it's close. But when Philippines yeah. is winning, it's Tom. That's game two, the story of game two and game four. Yeah. Which makes me excited for game five. As we head on to the closing minutes of the game, it's very hard to look for a break for Vietnam. Yes. Maybe you know if, they get, if they get a wipeout, uh, maybe yeah. two to three times in a row, that could be their window to win it. But with all inhibitors intact, it's going to be extremely hard, Manjin. I will now hit up Waterwolf because I think we're really gonna, gonna go to game five. Steve Max will also fall down in the hands of Black TZ. The TZ Brothers, it's the Carl TZ Show. There you go, the classic Team Philippines TP for game number four. It 